Just when you you think, oh, yeah, there's some hope we're going to get out of this shit show, they just keep dragging it out. And this prick, if it's so deadly, why haven't you died yet? You had it and you didn't die. Why? Really? Please. Please explain. And now they've come out and they're, they're just going to drag it out some more. Back home now, health experts are warning Victoria's COVID peak is not even in sight as our case numbers rise to their highest level in two months. The Premier says isolation rules won't be scrapped until the end of this outbreak. Back on deck after a ba- Seriously, what is this freaking outbreak? Like, there's all these people isolating at home. They've got nothing. They've just got to... They, they know somebody that supposedly had it. But none of his... Um, none of the people that went to the uh, the um, musical or whatever he went to the, um, the other night, why are they not all isolating? They're all there with him. You know, why haven't you... Why haven't you died yet? But seriously... How long can you drag this thing out? Like, if you had the flu, nobody's sitting at home saying, oh, I hope you survive, I hope you don't die. But all of a sudden we've got this frigging thing that's so bloody minuscule and it's an outbreak, it's a pandemic, and they're going to keep stretching it out. Out of COVID. And taking aim at the PM's comments around scrapping isolation rules. I'm looking forward to uh, that being removed. Ultimately, that's a decision for the Premier. Um, We don't make those decisions at the Commonwealth level. This is, you know, somebody else's job. No. The Premier claims it's an... It's not your job either, mate. I think we've all got rights as human beings to do what we wish over something so pissy that you're out of bed already, you're out on the street talking to everyone, shaking hands, licking balls, and, 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 and keeping this shit show going. What the... What? When did people get so fucking retarded? It is. It's like you, you haven't got COVID. You just got you're retarded. National issue because National Cabinet, which is chaired by the Commonwealth, asked the Australian Health Principal Protection Committee (AHPPC), again chaired by the Commonwealth, to have a look at this very issue. Those health experts. Hang on a minute. You've all had your vaccines. Why are you still? Why are you still running and hiding under your bed? None of it makes sense. Please explain. Like, why is this guy playing Monopoly with himself? You might as well be fucking at work. But no. Oh, we're going to keep you all at home. We're not only you public service frigging people who shouldn't even have a job anyway because they don't do anything. Obviously, if they're able to stay at home. Um, yeah, this is just becoming a joke. This is dress dragging it out. They're just punishing us even more. If you haven't partaken in this stupid program, we're sitting here fine and healthy, and the only people that are getting sick are the people that have had it. And and it's like, how long? And you're all isolating at home, and none of you are even scratching your head going, hang on, I've had this thing, but I'm still catching this thing, and I'm still coming up positive because you keep playing this stupid frigging game say it wouldn't be safe to relax isolation rules until the peak has passed. The Victoria is sort of an outlier in the sense that there's no peak in sight. And as admission... There's no peak in sight. There's no... You're a friggin' pig. There's plenty of pigs inside. I said peak. Sorry, I misheard you. But seriously, you people are retarded. Like that guy there. What a fucking retard. Rise, many hospitals are preparing their... Oh, wow, there's 339 people in hospital. You, you cunts are retarded, seriously, if you, you're still playing this stupid game. There's people out there can't even get any workers because apparently the anti-vaxxed are, 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 are such a threat to you and you've all had your stupid sh- shit inoculations and obviously they don't work and they keep dragging it out. We're going to extend the pandemic bill again. Oh, my goodness. COVID wards. Over the course of April, we will see a steady increase in numbers. We are run by retards. And you want to keep voting these people in? You think any of them are better than the other? I'm watching the opposition. They're out. They've got photos up on the, on their Facebook going, oh, look at me. We're hanging out with Tony Abbott having dinner out and at Sofitel or whatever it is. You know, like they're just taking the piss out of you. They don't give a fuck. And you're going to go and vote for them. Seriously. 12,000 cases in Victoria today, and the rising numbers have prompted the education department... Yeah, cases with what? These friggin' stupid tests that mean nothing. 
They don't mean anything. There's people sitting at home pulling their cocks, thinking that they're sick, yeah, and and putting up posts and pictures of their their tests saying it's positive, and everybody rubbing their balls, going, "I hope you're okay. I hope you don't die." While you're fucking sitting there having a great time, getting paid for it, while people that have said no can't get think get shit. And to extend rat testing in schools into term two. Victoria's pandemic declaration is due to expire on April 12, but with cases rising, the health minister has indicated that it will be extended, but he can't say if it will be the last time. This is just going to keep going forever, guys. You're going to keep playing this game? I, I can't say, oh, yeah, you know, you've already had 66% of years or whatever have had the third dose. So what are you, when are you pulling up yet? Just shut the fuck up, seriously. Uh, if you're going to keep playing, we're, we're fucked. That's all I can say. I've actually said in the past we didn't support the extension of it last time with the pandemic legislation and we won't be supporting it now. Chanel yeah. Vella. And what's that mean? It means jack shit. So thanks for your wasting our time. Stop voting for these clowns, seriously. I'm going. If I can get out of here.